Boy, oh boy, do we have something for you. The infamous map stating rumour has finally been confirmed. Last season's hottest con participants, Duncan and Evelyn, have finally found love with each other. Yeah, they have. Oh, yeah. The pair took to the internet to announce their exciting relationship earlier this week, and we are thrilled to say the lovebirds love join birds. us live in studio. Morning, you guys. Morning. First of all, Duncan, you lied to us. You lied to on this couch. Did on you lie to us on this you couch? You lied to us. Oh, look, it's just gut, you know. You're not Answer at that point. Question, you're not Duncan. really sure. You're not. So you weren't sure. Weren't sure about what you could say or not say. Okay. But so you were this, was when, this was when you were spotted yeah. getting a little hot and heavy inside the nightclub, right? Yeah. And were yeah, things were happening night. then? Take us back. What was happening then? It was on like Donkey Kong, wasn't when it? When did this happen? Oh, so uh, Mardi Gras, we hung out together. Um, yeah, Mardi Gras. And then a couple of weeks later, after forming a pretty good friendship, there was, a, you know, a few kisses and then it sort of went from there. OK, so... we don't need any more after the kisses. That's enough. Yeah. So, <laughs> okay, that's... Um, Evelyn, let's bring you in on this. When did you realise that perhaps that there was a frisson going on between you and Duncan? Well, I think Sounds everyone delicious. saw it coming before we even did. Right, so, like, happens. every good relationship, we started hanging out as friends good. and we got to know each other on a deeper level and then I started to get the feels and then I was like, oh, crap. But, like, when, when he walked in on Mass or when you walked into Mass and you're sort of like, OK, so I'm, you know, I'm with this guy and we're going to give it a shot and he looked around the room and be like, well, what about this handsome guy? <laughs> yeah. You didn't think that, Evelyn, at all? Obviously, I thought he was really hot, but nice. I think I need to know someone more before, sure. you know, developing romantic feelings. And when I did know Duncan more, I was like, OK, so he's hot and a good person. So just to set the record straight, nothing happened between you two during the experiment. Absolutely, Absolutely not. not. This mm. is a post-experiment. And Duncan, you wouldn't have even dreamed thing. of looking at her twice during the experiment. No, you're, um, although I thought she was obviously extremely attractive the first time she walked into the room when I saw her, um, okay. you're so emotionally in, like, it's such a pressure cooker of a situation that you're, all your focus and energy, especially for me, was trying to work on my relationship at the time and trying to see if it was the right one, and it obviously wasn't, so Well, look, I, I think we could all tell watching the show you weren't really matched with your sure. everlasting loves. That, that obviously was that the happens. truth of the matter. Um, so it's wonderful that you found love. In each other. After oh, is it the love? Show. Is it love? Well, well, you found a connection in each other after the show. Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. I shouldn't do that. It's very mumsy of me. Isn't oh, it? we're sorry. Um, but how have the other mass contestants responded to this news, this announcement? I think we've had really positive feedback, and like I said before, most of our cast mates were like, "Yeah, we saw this coming before you guys even wow. did." So again, it's like, did everyone see it besides us? Yeah. I think so. All the boys were super supportive. I tech, uh, you know, they all. Rupert is Rupert supportive? Yeah, definitely. And Alyssa? Oh. Uh, I haven't had much haven't contact heard. with Alyssa, so. <laughs> but Rupert. Uh, so one out of two. <laughs> you know, swings and roundabouts, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Um, so look, guys, it must be really hard though because there is a lot of public scrutiny around maths. There's a lot of paps mm. around there that are going to try and get you guys. How are you going to control this and and you know, keep yourselves, you know, keep the Insulated purity of the love? Yeah. Yeah, look, I, th I thought about that a lot. And, you know, at the start of when we were trying to date without anyone sort of knowing about it, you've got to come up with, like, really interesting ways of trying to fund things that don't involve going to, like, a nice restaurant where you might get seen by someone. So right? what did you do? Sorry? What were you doing? Oh, so whether it was, like... Uh, on the back of the motorbike and going down to some secluded beaches or going... We did a few boat days. I got my boat licence. Um, or whether they were, like, games inside my unit that I'd come okay, up with. We played board games. Yeah. Board okay. games? Yeah. yeah. They really, really got to know each other. Twister? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Sorry, Mum. <laughs> yeah. yeah. uh, okay, so do you know what? I really, it was really cute, the announcement that you did online. Um, it was very official. Like, why did you feel the need to sort of announce it in such a formal way? Well, look, I think it was the right thing. We were, you know, really thankful for Nine and Mass for, you know, putting us together. Otherwise, we wouldn't have, we wouldn't have met each other if we hadn't gone on the show, right? So we wanted mm. to do the right thing um, through the, you know, the organisation that looked after us and then also um, be able to say it the way that it happened and not let sort of people come up with their own thoughts mm. around how things happened. Should we just re-up the show right now and get you two married? What do you reckon? <laughs> what? Should we just yeah, let's call Entertainment, John. MC, <laughs> we're available. We'll call John, yeah. Seriously, yeah. we're not we'll, kidding? Uh, we'll MC. <laughs> yeah. we're, we're a song, available. what do you need? We, we, we're here, we're, we're in. Yeah, I'm keen. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Evelyn is staying very strong on all of this now. She's keeping very tidy.
<laughs> I love it. Well, look, it's wonderful. We love um, it. This we is the third you. success story from this, this season, awesome. right? Mm. Tani and Ollie are still together. Yep. Uh, you, Leighton and Melinda. Mm -hmm. Is that right? And yes. you guys. So that's a pretty, that's that's a pretty a, good strike that's right a good for one strike season right of maps. maps. Thank you, bad. Married at First Sight. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Um, guys, <laughs> lovely to see you so happy and together. Good thank well you. done. And thank you. Congratulations. Thank Thanks for having you. us on. Wonderful. Wonderful. Appreciate love it. Love is love, everybody. Love, love is love. love. Friday, get onto it. <laughs> get onto what? Get onto love. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had said that. I don't mean these two, I mean you guys. We'll be right back. Dad. Hey there, Today fans, Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. that never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?